track kills, man. What is up, loud and proud crowd? Hopefully you guys are doing absolutely fantastic today. So, a lot of stuff, a lot of big stuff coming up here we got to do, but today, let's get let's get to today's video first. We have got to do the taillights on the Duramax. Third brake light on the Duramax. We've got to black out both the emblems. And that's probably mostly what we're gonna be doing in today's video right now. We're in Rosine, headed to grab some food because it's freaking, we're freaking cold and hungry, mostly hungry right now. Like it feels like, you know, you ever get so hungry that it literally feels like knives in your gut twisting around? Like that's how hungry I am right now. It's not good. So we're gonna go get some, we're gonna go get some food in the system and then we're gonna go and get to working on some videos all day. Don't forget to go grab your LNP merch, LNP beanies, hoodies, hats. We got uh, keychains, all sorts of stuff. Go grab that stuff. The Duramax giveaway ends on March 26th. So look at your calendars. It's already in March. We're already into March. A few days here. So check your calendars. March 26th, the giveaway is over. Pretty sure we have less than 20 days by the time you see this video. So do not procrastinate. Get in on that giveaway. Because I'm pretty sure by the time you see this, we should have like only like only a little bit more than two weeks or maybe right around two weeks left. So keep that in mind, check your calendars, get entered every $15 you spend on team-lmp.myshopify.com is another automatic entry to win the 2008 LMM Duramax, which you're gonna see in today's video. So keep that in mind, information in the description below. Shop the new shop, mind you. Plug loud and proud diesel trucks on the gram. Rosine 24V on the gram. So she's got some stuff she's gonna do to her truck today, which I will leave that for her video. However, we have got some final touches to make on the old Dirty Max to make it just really pop. Just those extra little things to make it look good. That bow tie in the front. It's gotta go black to match the headlights and the cab lights. And then we gotta get some smoked fog lights here too, before too long. We've got to do the, another plug, I'm trying to do some trucks on Instagram, follow. We're almost to 50K on the gram. So we've got the third brake light we gotta change out today. Hopefully there's no complications with that. And then we're gonna change out the tail lights and the bow tie in the rear. Now tail lights are generally very easy. Stranger things have happened. So you, you just never know. But uh, hopefully they're not very hard. I've never had, ever had an issue with tail lights, but you never know. Um, but yeah, so that's the, that's the agenda for this video of mine. If you guys want to see what she's up to with her train horns and stuff, all that jazz, it's gonna be, she's got a lot of stuff going on on her channel too soon. And we're even gonna show you guys some of the stuff going on with this truck very soon. Anyway, so this truck, it's gonna look freaking awesome. Let's just say, yeah, yeah, it's, it's gonna look really awesome. It's gonna look really freaking crazy. So we're gonna get onto this truck right now. But don't forget guys, grab the LMP gear, information down in the description below, and you can be taking home that beautiful Duramax. Also the beanies, oh my gosh. I was wearing this outside this morning. It's freaking cold, so cold. Now I'm back in the LMP cap because we got the heater in here which will keep, keep this a constant like 65, 75 degrees. So we don't have to use, you know, the beanies when we can have the, the other really cool Richardson caps on. So uh, but yeah, we're gonna get into this right now and give this truck a much better look. Was not able to get the actual process of what I did on video. It was very easy and it's very self-explanatory. And my, my little camera helper is busy filming her own videos, which I'm very proud of. Um, but let's go and show you what we did here. Let me get these two mirrors close, because these Dodge tow mirrors, you know, they like to knock people out. But um, so here's the rear badge. It's not dried all the way, so it, it'll, it'll level out a little bit nicer and look a lot better once it's fully dried. I peel all this tape off. 
Uh, but I'm gonna wait till it dries to where there's no like moisture on the surface um, before I peel that tape off and I'll get to the tail lights. Same with the front one, it looks the same because I seriously just finished this like a minute ago, so it's not dry yet. Well, here's the front two. And again, all the little, little bits that are kind of like bubbles still, um, those, they kind of self-level. They're kind of like a self-smoothening um, type of thing because every time that it's dried so far, it's pretty much dried itself out and then it was all nice and smooth and then I applied it again and then it looks the same every time. But so essentially, all you do is actually a nail on this tire. <laughs> There's a nail in one of these tires, babe. Really? Yeah. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. Clearly it still holds air, but anyways, th these are temporarily gonna be on her truck, which you'll see her video before you even see this one, because this is gonna be a little while ahead, but um, these are going in her truck temporarily, just because there's some new new coming for her truck. So that's the only reason why these are on temporarily, and we're selling her wheels and tires in the 22 by 10 Hostiles, just to get them out of the shop because we don't have any trucks and need them on right now because this truck's got its own set coming. Longhorn's already got anthems rocking on it. The first one's already got anthems off the Duramax. These ones that are going back on it. Um, so we, we just don't, we don't need these, nor do we really prefer to run hostile or gear. <laughs> but uh, we're gonna just sell those and give somebody else a good deal on that stuff. But anyway, so we're gonna get that stuff peeled off here pretty soon. And all I did was I masked off the bow tie, all the chrome around the bow tie, and then only did like the golden portion of the bow tie itself and it should turn out really nice once I peel it off it'll actually look really good. Then with the tail lights we're gonna get to installing those very momentarily and it should look really really good when it's done. I'm gonna actually try to get the tail light installed on camera though. Looks good. In the tail lights, which you'll see in just a minute when we kick them on, hopefully. And these are supposed to match the fronts, the uh, headlights. There's the bow tie. It'll focus. We're going to see if I can get the lighting here. I'm not going to start it up, but see if I can get the lighting on to see how the lights look. Pretty good, pretty good. These are in the description, by the way. The headlights, tail lights, third brake light, all that stuff is in the description if you guys are looking to pick this stuff up for your truck. Or if you want to at least check out the brand and maybe find something like that for your truck. Maybe it's not a Chevy, but links in the description for the products used if I can find links for them. Right turn, turn signal? Yep. That? Yes. Good. Good, good. Yep. All good. Sweet. We're going to finish her truck with her real quick. And I've got some other stuff I got to do today, but that's pretty much it for this video. But you guys can see the lights look completely blacked out when they're not on, but when they are on, clear as day. I'll wear the tail lights and I think they look really freaking good. They really do look really good. You know, maybe some of these people are new and they haven't seen the headlights yet. 
maybe there's some new subscribers up in it. So swing around to the front and show them what the headlights look like just so they know that they're a matching type of deal here. In terms of like the cool modern outline, you know, style of thing we got going on here. They on? Mm-hmm. The like bars around the headlights? Mm-hmm. So there's the headlights too. So yeah, everything finally is tied together on this truck. We've got a couple more things that we're gonna do. As you guys know from a couple of videos back, we did just install a three inch lift kit. Somebody's like, oh my gosh, dude, a, a, just a front three inch leveling kit is gonna ride like crap, don't do it. I'm like, it's a three inch lift. So the whole truck is lifted three inches. I remember saying, we're gonna do a three inch leveling kit. It's, it wasn't a three inch level. Is a three inch lift. So they're still two inches lower in the front than the rear, but front and rear both went up three inches, not like four in the front, two in the rear, that type of deal. Here's another look at the bow tie. Like I said, once it once it dries, it's all smooth. It looks like a factory black bow tie. If it'll focus right there. That's how good it looks after it after it's all uh dried, it all smoothens out, looks really nice. Does it look good? You like it? Looks good. Recap, we did the front bow tie, back bow tie, third brake light, and tail lights today. We got a lot more stuff that we gotta do. However, not in this video, because we gotta wrap this up and uh, get on going. Also, I left my camera charger at Devon's. So when you see this, Devon, I left my camera battery charger at your shop. And so I'm gonna have to go buy another one because it's easier and quicker to go buy another one than to go up there and grab it and come back. So that's what we're gonna be doing so we can keep filming videos throughout the day because this camera's about to die. So thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Do not forget to go and enter this giveaway for this truck. 2008 LMM Duramax, 2500 HD. Beautiful truck, clean truck, runs great. A lot of new stuff coming to it still. We got the three inch lift kit put on it, headlights, taillights, third brake light, bow ties. Um, we've got some stuff going under the hood, something under the rear. Wheels and tires are gonna be going on within just a couple of videos here. And this truck's gonna look really killer, really fast, and this giveaway's ending rapidly. I think by the time you see this, there's like maybe two weeks left. Maybe less than that. Just check the dates. It ends March 26th at 11.59 p.m. And then it's over, and then it's done. So every $15 is another entry to win. Information in the description below. Leave a fat thumbs up on this video. Leave your comments down below. Subscribe if you're new, join the team, join the family, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace.